Hi guys, I'm Carmen and today I'm going to be showing you guys my makeup collection and all of my stuff that I use on my face right here. I want to apologize too that I haven't been filming videos probably for a long time. So yeah, I'm going to just film whenever I want and if I feel like filming I will but it's kind of, you know. So let's get started. We're just gonna get started on something simple. So I got some uh, makeup wipes, obviously. So I have the makeup wipe room cleansing wipes and vitamin C. This is really good. And it's rose, rose smelling one. And it's good because it's rose oil. And then I got the regular Neutrogena. Makeup remover wipes. Okay, now let's get on to the actual like, stuff. Also, I have a mirror in here. You know, so I can, when I need to go places, I will go. And another thing, this is my makeup bag. It's a Victoria's Secret makeup bag, and I got it for Christmas from my cousin. She got it for me, and I absolutely love it so i'm just gonna grab whatever i find first and then just show you guys and then if you don't mind me i'm gonna do put over here so you know, don't get lost the first thing i have is my anastasia contour kit i got it in the shades light to medium so i have all of these shades i usually mostly use this one or this one because contouring you know it's a long process so i just have those and and if you see flies around yeah there's a fly in here somewhere so yeah next that i have is some lashes i don't know where i got these from they were gifted to me but these are really good i wore these prom my prom and they're so good i love them to thank you to my cousin Next I have is my Super Glub Unseen Sunscreen. SPF is really important. And I just learned that just now. I got this yesterday. <laughs> but I wore it today and it's so good on my skin. It feels so nice. And I needed an SPF and this one had really good reviews so I got it. And I'll let you guys know if I like it. Because this, uh, this is the first day I'm using it and I'm going to the fair. And I'm gonna be there going there all night. And I don't really burn that much. So, but it's really important. So, yeah. Yes. Next thing I got is my Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Use this all the time. I love it. Use it today. And my makeup look great today. Thanks to this. And hopefully it will stay all night. Well, not hopefully. I already know it's gonna stay all night. But yeah, that's good. Next thing I got is also, I went to, on a shopping spree yesterday and got a bunch of stuff from Ulta. And I got the Fendi Beauty highlighter in the colors Lightning Dust and Fire Crystal. And this is what it looks like. Haven't used it yet, but maybe when I use it, I'll let you guys know what I think. Maybe I'll just do a review on all the makeup I have and see if I like it. Next thing I got is an oldie but a goodie, and I got the Air Spun, Air Spun Boost Face Powder. I've used this quite a lot, and it's really good. You know, it's just really good. It's an oldie but a goodie, and it's very cheap. And I got this at, I think Dollar General, and I saw this, and it was like five bucks, so really good. Next thing I got is the Kylie blush pressed powder blush and it's in the shade farah joss farah josh i don't know it says back here farah joss and it's really pretty use this so good i love it to death next thing i got is the smashbox the original photo finish smooth and blur primer love this used it all the time so good and you know prime that face make that it's nice and smooth and it's really good. Love it. 
Next thing I got is the Benefit Hula Toasted Bronzer. And it's really good. I use this too a lot. And yeah, it's just good. Next thing I got is the Rem Beauty Baby Doll Eyeshadow Palette. And it's in nude colors. Got this yesterday, so I haven't used it yet. But it's really pretty colors. And I like to go natural. So if I'm getting an eyeshadow palette, I mostly get nudes. Because, you know, I still want to keep this natural look. Don't want to go too crazy. Next thing I got is another Rem Beauty. And it's the mother earth highlighter really good use this sometimes depending on what highlighter i want to use and this is really good yeah. next thing i got is the a fenty gloss in the shade fenty glow it's so pretty i'm using it right now this is what it looks like on my lips it's pretty good i got this yesterday love it Love the glosses, so pretty. And the next thing I got is another REM Beauty product, and it's the Under Eye Balm. Just used this today. It felt so good. Moisturizing, it's so good. And I love the little bottle, it's cute. And yeah, I'll let you guys know if I like this or not. Whew, I feel like I'm running out of breath already. Next I got is probably a. Everybody loves this, and it's the. Fendi Beauty bronzer stick and I got mine in the shade Mocha and this is what it looks like. Used it today, use it all the time, love this so much, so good. Yeah. Next thing I have is some lotion, some Eurocerin, is that how you say it? I don't know. But this is really good. You know, if you have dry skin, so moisturize it up and you feel so good after. Next thing I have is a Bath and Body Works exfoliating lip scrub. Sorry, in the sh in the like flavor of sugar rose, and I use this a lot. It smells so good, and it tastes good too. If you get it in your mouth, you're just like, mm, it's kind of good. That's I know that's weird, but. It's it's good, it's just that good. Next thing I got is the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. Love this mascara. I'm wearing it today. So cute. And love this to death. It's my number one mascara that I use. I have a couple, but this is the one I go to the most because it's really good. Next thing I got is the Wet n Wild Highlighter Powder. This is like my OG. Like when I first started getting makeup, this is my first ever highlight, like makeup product that I bought. And it's cute, she's cute. Works really okay. Could be better though, but it's like, you know, you never know what you're gonna get when you buy makeup for the first time, but I got that and it, it's all right. Next thing I got is the Tarte Ultra Concealer Shape Tape Concealer in the shade ultra creamy love this uses all the time it's i think everybody already has i think everybody has this in their makeup collection it's just really good really good next thing i got and i use this all the time and it is the navia soft moisturizing cream and you can put this on your face on your body on your hands cream this is just anywhere moisturizing cream and i use it on my face before putting on makeup so my makeup or not my makeup but my face is nice and smooth before i put makeup on and it's so good and i like how small it is it's a good size and it comes in like like that and i use this all the time before i put on makeup makes my face nice and smooth and you know all that jazz next thing i got probably everybody has this and it's the rare beauty liquid blush and i got mine in the shade happy so good using it right now my go-to blush so cute i like dewy things i like when my face is dewy because you know i like the dewy look and of course everybody has one of these and it's 
eyelash curler. I got two of these. I got this was my very first one. Use it sometimes. This is my new one that I use now. I have two, just in case if I want to switch it up, use this one or this one. I, I have options. Next thing I have, and I have a lot of these in here, so I just could grab all of them. Okay, I have some hand sanitizers. I have these, which are some Bath and Body Works one. I have the Japanese cherry blossom and then I have the cactus blossom. These are good. I keep them in my makeup bag, you know, so like after like when I put on makeup, I get makeup on my hands. And if I don't have anywhere to wash my hands, I can just use these or I have also the touch lamp hydrating mist hand sanitizer. It's also good. It smells good too. Both of, all of these actually smell good. Yeah. Next, I have a couple of beauty blenders. And they're all kind of dirty right now. But I mostly use these for powder. I don't really use them that much. I like to use brushes more than I use all of these. But they're, they're still good, you know. Next thing I got, and this kind of goes hand in hand, so maybe just hopefully I can find it. Oh, there it is. So I have, I bought a Kylie lip kit, and I got this lip liner, and it came in a package. And I got the shade Posy K, and this is Posy K too, and it looks like this. Tried this, and I don't know if I like the color that much. It's a little bit pink for me, but I still love it anyway. Maybe I'll, like, if I go out somewhere or have an event or just, like, want to be nice and do a different kind of lip, I will go for this, but not for every day. It's a little too much for me, but it's okay. Next thing I have is another... Rem Beauty highlighter, and I but I got in a different shade. I got it in Miss Mercury. I use this a lot, as you can tell. It's like a little used, but it's really good. I love it so much. One of my go to highlighters. Next thing I got is a little melting blush, and I got it in the shade Nearly Rosy. Rose. Little Nearly Rose, and I was like that. Love it. It's really good. Almost, it's almost like the liquid blush, but it's just a little bit more like like that. You can just tap it on your face, but it's really good. And I also got another lip scrub, and this one is Wix, Wixy Winky Lux. And I don't really use this one, this one that often. It's still okay, but hold on. It looks like that. It looks kind of gross, but trust me, it works. But I don't really go for this one that often. It tastes gross, and that's just the only downfall I don't like about it. It's just it tastes gross. Next that I got, I don't know, this used to be my favorite, and it's the Tarte C Con Alt Hydro Concealer, and I got in the shade Light Medium Honey. This is my good. This used to be like my, my favorite, but. As you can tell, it's like nearly gone. Sad about it, and it's hard to find this. And I would try to find it for like two years now, and I can't. Don't know where I can get this, but it's still good. Love it to death. Still my OG. OG. And next thing I got is the Coas concealer, and I got it in the shade. What is in the shade? I can't find it, but I'm used. I use this today. It's my shade. Love this. Very good. Woo. Okay. And hold on. This is a package deal. So hold on. Give me a second to find all of these because these are all like literally all the same. Okay, I think I got all of them. And these are the Victoria's Secret lip glosses. And I have six of these. I have Strawberry Fizz. 
I got QB Blush, got Honey Shine, uh, Candy Baby, Cider Glow, and Juicy Melon. And these are all good. Love Victoria's Secret. Victoria's Secret lip glosses. <laughs> My brain went slow just now. But the, yeah, these are, are nice. These are good. Taste good. Smell good. Feel good on my lips. Everything. That's a package deal. Next thing I have is the Too Faced Damn Girl Mascara. And this is new. It's a new mascara, but it's really good. Love this. It's like up there with Better Than Sex Mascara. Because it's Too Faced. I love Too Faced's mascara. But yeah. That's good. Next is... I have the Benefit Gimme Brow, and they're kind of faded, but love these, use these all the time, and I used it today too, it's on my eyebrows, and these are good, love these. Um, next thing I have is another Benefit Brown, I got it in the shade Neutral Medium Brown, don't really use that this one that often, if I want to do something extra, I will go for this, but for every day, I would just do the benefit brow brushes. Next thing I got are kind of a package deal. And here are a bunch of my eyebrow pencils. I got, this is my very first one, it's the Wet n Wild brow. And it's kind of, don't have a sharp renew, so I couldn't really, can't really use that anymore. And then I have the L'Oreal Paris brow pencil it looks like that and then these ones too are the same and i used to love wearing this one i still wear this one sometimes but it's the nyx professional makeup micro pencil and i have two of these this one kind of this one broke and the lid has like the top thing stuck in it so i can't put the lid back on which sucks and then i have this one I don't, I don't ever use this one. I kind of just use the brush to brush out my eyebrows after I put gel on. But other than that, I kind of don't really use this one. But yeah, it's pretty okay. Next thing I have is the L'Oreal. Hold on, there's one thing to it. Where is it? There's another thing to it. Oh, there it is. Okay. And it's probably like my very first eyeliner that I got. And it comes with a little stencil. You can put it right here and do the wing liner look if you want. It's pretty good. It looks like that. It's pretty good. It still is really good. Yeah, I use that one sometimes. And I got two more Fendi lip glosses. I have the clear gloss in the shade Gloss Slipper, just basic. And then I got the Diamond Milk, which is pretty shiny. Love those. Tastes good too for some reason. I don't know why I like tasting them, but yeah. Next thing I got is the Wixi Link lipstick, and it's pretty. I used it before, and it's pretty. It has a little flower in it. And when you put it on, it comes out in the shade Pink. So it looks clear. It looks clear, but like when you put it on, it turns pink, which is pretty, which is pretty cool. Love that. Next thing I got, and these two go hand in hand because I have two of them, and it's the Rem Beauty eyeliner pencil or crayon. This one broke, so I had to get a new one, and now I have this one, and it's pretty good. Love it. Not a big on the eyeliner person, but you know, if I want to put eyeliner, I have a way to do it. And this one's kind of the same thing, but it's the Rem Beauty, what is it called? Eyeliner marker. And it looks like this. And it's pretty good too. Love it. Haven't tried it because I'm not big on eyeliner. This is my OG concealer, and this is the first concealer I ever used, and it was the L'Oreal Paris and Fallible Full Wear in the shade. Oh, it doesn't have a shade. <laughs> but this is my OG. Used this like when I first started using makeup. Still have it and it's still good. Still good. Yeah. 
Next thing I have is a LA colored lippy gloss, sheer lip gloss. It's pretty good. Love this. And if you want a clear gloss, then this is good. And it's if you're on a budget, this is only like 99 cents. And it's really good if you just want a clear lip gloss. Next thing I have is this Laura Merci Mer Mercier lip gloss. And this is like a really old one, but pretty good. Still works. And then next I have the Cosmetics BR Satin Lip Gloss. Li lip gloss. Lipstick, actually, but it looks like a gloss to me, but haven't tried that one yet. It's pretty new. Next thing I have is another gloss, and it's the L'Oreal Paris Inflaming Pro Gloss. Looks like this. It's a pretty color. Haven't used this one that much yet either. But it's pretty good, I guess. Next thing I have is the Rem Beauty Plumping Lip Gloss in the shade VCR. It's pretty cute. Haven't tried this one yet either, but I'll let you guys know. Next thing I have, and this is kind of cute, but I have the little hydro concealer one haven't used this yet but if i do I'll let you guys know it's pretty cute love the little mini size and i also got the mini sizes of the tart shape tape as well and i pretty much use this on little blemishes and stuff if i wanted to go super natural but you know the makeup no makeup kind of thing next thing i have is the rare beauty lip liner in the shade kind words looks like this. Use this. It's pretty good. Love this. Next thing I have, and, and this is like a really like cheap product. It's the same thing as the BR one. And it's the lip pencil in the shade pink. And it looks like that. I got it from my cousin. Don't know where, how much or anything like that. Next thing I have is the Benefit Dandelion Twinkle Highlighter. Looks like that. Pretty good if you want Shh, like a fancy kind of looking one. Next thing I have is the Tarte Packing Bronzer. It's a little messy, but it works. Got this from a friend. Gave it to me. And then next thing I got is the Chanel mascara in the shade Noir. And it's a uh, traveling size and it's really good. Use this under my eyes mostly. Don't really use it that much, but I put it under my eyes and it's really good. And I went to the Chanel store and got this and it's pretty cute. And this one kind of is a package deal. It's just a bunch of Lipsticks and Carmex, or I mean chapsticks and Carmex. Pretty good. You really need those. Yeah, I just got just the regular one, and then I have the SPF 15 sunscreen strawberry flavored one, and then I have the Skittles, which is pretty good, and green apple. And of course, you can't really forget about these. Just have this for my eyebrows, tweezers. Another tweezers and the eyebrow shaver. And the next, I have a lash glue. And it's nice. Really good. Work, use it. And it's the duo one, I mean. And then I have Vaseline. Rosy lips. Really good. Vaseline's always good. And then lastly, I have. Just a little perfume, and it's the Viva La Juicy perfume. Love this. It's a traveling size one, just in case if I forgot, and I'll just spray everywhere. But that is it for my makeup collection and everything I have in my makeup. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and hope we'll see you next time. Bye!